Welcome in CACPHP tutorial. In this tutorial, we will see how we can create a custom middleware and uh, we will implement it in our application. So you can see an application. So here I want to apply a condition and that is if user have no any company information. So you can see there is no any company information. Then user will redirect at company page when user will access this web application so that's the condition that i wanted to implement in here so let's proceed so first you I, I will create a middleware in here so i'm in here in my docker container so if you are in uh, project read uh, project uh, root directory then you just need to give a command bin cagback middleware and i'm just giving here the name of my middleware called company so after hit on, hit on enter uh, a middleware will be create so this is the middleware that have uh, generated by back command so after that you need to register or add this middleware in your application.php so here you can see i have already used this middleware in here and i have added this middleware in this middleware method in here so you can see i add this middleware that means company middleware after the authentication middleware so there is actually a reason if you require authentication information in your company middleware then you have to call this uh, or add this middleware after the authentication middleware if you add it before the authentication middleware then you will not get any authentication information in your company middleware so let's see so i'm in here so i'm just going to uh, dd that means debug or die this request object so let's see the request object what actually it's returning so i already in login state so that means i'm already login and if you just reload your page you will see the request object so now if you go in attribute uh, so there is the identity um, attribute and you can see in this identity element there is the data and in this data there has the authentication information in here so depend on this condition that's company if there is no any company id then i will redirect, redirect the user in in the company at page so i will give the condition depend on this uh, company id so let's go in here so i will just give a condition in here so the condition is like that okay so let's explain so first we will check that there has identity um, attribute uh, if uh, there is identity identity attribute that we will check uh, that there is the company id is null or not if it's null then i will go in here so here what i will do i will just redirect the user so i will give here the url and I will redirect this URL companies and action. So router, I have first created a, a URL using the router class. So we have to use this router class in top. And then I'm just using here the CACPHP response class. This is the response object that I created so i'm also using the http response in here and then uh, we'll we will give the full redirection that means 302 redirection so the response with status 302 with with the uh, header location and i've just given this url so it will redirect in here so we'll return the response in here so after save so if you just now go in here and reload the page it will actually uh, will go in this uh, directory but keep in mind this middleware actually will work for your all routes that means uh, it will also work for your company's edit so we have to pre prevent it first so uh, let's let check uh, check first the current url so if this current url is company's edit 
if this current viewer let's company edit then it will return in default that means uh, um, the default page that means uh, company's edit page else it will go in here okay so if if it's it's true then it will uh, company's edit page it will by default it will go in here but else it will re redirect for other pages so let's see first so go in here redirect your page reload your page so you can see we are now in company edit page so if you just come in here so after click you can see that it's redirecting click here it's redirecting click here it's redirecting so <coughs> I know that you will say that you can uh, execute this condition by many others way for example you can execute this uh, condition in your application.php but it's actually a tutorial on how you can create a custom middleware in PHP and also you are able to add this uh, in your application and also note that that you also able to implement this middleware on the routes that if you have routes you also able to apply on the routes so this portion I have skipped in here but I've just given this tutorial how you can create a custom middleware and also add it in your application.php so thank you for watching this tutorial welcome for the next tutorial